Welcome to the Daily Writer Podcast, where we bring you tips and inspiration each day to help you build habits for writing success. For more resources, including your free Daily Writer Starter Kit, visit dailywriterlife.com. Before we get to today's episode, I want to share an incredible opportunity for you to grow as a writer. You know, listening to podcasts, reading emails and books, and getting on Zoom calls is great, but there's nothing quite like being in a small group of other writers who are making their writing dreams come true by publishing books and building their business. That's what the Daily Writer Retreat is all about. On May 2nd through the 4th, we will gather in beautiful St. Charles, Missouri, just outside of St. Louis, in a historic home to help you take a giant leap as a writer. We'll start with a classy dinner on Tuesday night, followed by two amazing days of connection, planning, teaching, and masterminding together. But don't take my word for it. Listen to what one of our Daily Writer Club members, MJ James, had to say about her experience at last fall's retreat. It's been amazing being here in these last two days. It's super fun. Not only did we get to delve deeper into the relationships that we have with one another and, and build possible collaboration efforts, which we're all super excited about, um, I think the biggest thing was sitting down and being able to feel excited about doing a small book. This was super exciting because a lot of times when I do client work, they come and they want these big, giant pieces done. And I have outlines in place for those and I've done those before and that's fine. But I think it's really motivational and inspiring to know not only how to do a small book, but how well they are working and performing for people who are doing small books, who have published small books, what that return on their invested time for those pieces are. So I think that was a great thing to learn. I'm super excited to delve into my next book. Thanks, MJ. Appreciate that. Hey, if you need a creative boost and you want to grow your writing into a part-time or full-time business, the Daily Writer Retreat is for you. The cost is just $475 and includes registration, materials, and all meals on Wednesday and Thursday. Now, this is a small retreat and spots are very limited, so head on over to dailywriterlife.com slash retreat to make sure and grab your spot today. That's dailywriterlife.com slash retreat. Okay, let's get to today's episode. I want you to take a moment and picture yourself as a third grader. It's May and you have two weeks of school left. The weather is warm and all you can think about is a fun-filled summer full of sprinklers, fireworks, and ice cream. Yet, you sit there at your uncomfortable desk, listening to the teacher droning on and on about some subject you're not really interested in. You'd rather be anywhere but here. You know, we never quite escape this impulse of wanting to be done with school, of wanting to be done with our education. We move on to middle school, high school, and maybe college, and maybe even grad school. And with every level, we just want to be done so we can get on with our life. And this doesn't change even when you get to the doctoral level. Ask any PhD student in the middle of their dissertation, and they will likely say, I just want to be done with this thing. Well, this is the kind of attitude most people expect from formal education, where we follow somebody else's prescribed path for success. Now, there are a lot of benefits to formal education, of course, but nothing compares to the curriculum that you create for yourself. If you want to grow as a writer, you have to change your mindset about learning. Learning is a privilege, not an obligation. Learning can happen anywhere, not just in a prescribed institution. Learning is the match that lights the fire of passion and purpose, not the bucket of water that drowns it out. As Ernest Hemingway once said, we're all apprentices in a craft where no one ever becomes a master. So my friend, you must make time to learn every day, whether it's books, podcasts, courses, videos, masterminds, or some other kind of learning opportunity, you've got to make it a priority. Even just a few minutes of learning every day can change the whole course of your life in just one short year. Now, you might have a master's degree, but the truth is that you never truly become a master. You're always an apprentice. So, what are you learning today? Here's today's challenge. Before you go to bed tonight, share what you have learned today with some other person, whether it's by text, email, or somebody in your family. Don't overthink it. Just share. Thanks for listening, and I'll see you next time.